Roderick Cushing guys filming a new medical drama at Plywood Studios. Just what we need, another show about a handsome doctor. If anyone from Plywood Productions is listening, I'm, I'm still waiting to hear back about my show. I don't want to spoil it for you, but let's just say it's about a professional bowler that solves interdimensional mysteries. Actually, that's that's pretty much it. Andrews
This is Two Point Radio with Ricky Hawthorne. And if you're feeling a bit under the weather, you're in luck because my voice is the best medicine. Unless you're really sick, in which case you should go to a hospital. Doctor required in GP's office. And in today's news, a group of Grockle Bay residents are staging a protest against the planned development of a permanent bouncy castle. The group believes the money would be better spent building a bouncy pirate ship instead.
announcement, medical waste does not belong in the corridors. Bongle have announced an initiative to eliminate hangnails by the year 2072. This will require the construction of a lunar base in which to conduct zero-gravity nail experiments. Money well spent, I'm sure you'll agree.
hospital will not be considered patients. If you're feeling ill, the last thing you want to do is pump your body full of cheap artificial medicine. So stay at a Holistics Hospital, where our natural remedies are so expensive, they just have to be good for you. Holistics, where you can only hope it sticks. Zombie Two Point County. This is Two Point Radio. Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. 
Would you believe it? A new study shows Two Point County is dangerously unhealthy. Well, that's why I like to do my part with the segment Get Fit with Rick. Stay tuned for some top fitness tips. Training course complete. Class dismissed. In this edition of Get oh. Fit with Rick, I'd like to introduce you to my two favorite yoga positions. 
first is one I like to call the suspicious otter, which really gives your pelvic basement a good workout. All you have to do is wrap your thighs around your head. Easy! My second favorite yoga position is what I like to call the cantankerous limpet, which really helps to strengthen your cheeks. You'll have to come down to the station for a practical demonstration of that one.
some alarming reports of an earthquake causing considerable damage to a local hospital. Hope nobody broke anything, but if you did, at least you're in the right place for it. want to experience all that the pointy mountains have to offer stay at the underlook hotel you'll never want to leave thanks you're welcome amazing underlook hotel serving two point county this is two point radio
And we finish our show with our nice words of the day. Today's quote comes from Avril Cumberbund. Sadness is not the opposite of happiness. The opposite of happiness is cinepapa. How wonderfully literal.
Lord, please. There's a fire. There shouldn't be a fire. the list. 
poster that you dropped on our floor.
injection room. Welcome back. I've been keeping as still as possible in case this mysterious package responds to movement. Or maybe it responds to sound. What if it's on a timer? Hmm. I think I need your help. What could be the trigger? How long do I have? Let me know. Here are some thinking tunes. The health inspector is coming. Please try to look healthy. Warning. Earthquake imminent. This next song is for all the hospital patients shaken up by that earthquake. Hope all your internal organs are still in the right place.
All right, Delphine Finger Sandwich says the package probably contains a scandalous picture of you and a blackmail note. Or maybe a slightly smaller package. Many of you have suggested that I destroy the package. Brian Cleft says, hit it with so many hammers. Uh, Brian man, we don't have all that many hammers lying around the station, so why don't you pull your head out of your... I apologize. The situation may be starting to get the better of me. If you're looking for a product with which to clean your hair, we at Juster would like to ask that you consider our shampoo. Yeah, all right. Juster shampoo. It'll clean your hair, but it won't change your life. Serving Two Point County. This is Two Point Radio.
thinking about your suggestions and you're right I could destroy the package but who am I to bludgeon the inviting face of destiny and this package is after all for me I've seen every possibility it always ends with me opening the package it's just a matter of time Thank you. 
I believe Stockholm Syndrome has begun to rear its ugly head. My respect for the package and its potential for danger has developed into a strange kind of affection, living with it forever in a constant state of opening is becoming a very real, even pleasing possibility. Whatever is next can be our song. How about that? a low point, but I'm going to do it now. During their last song, I came to terms with my own demise, and I'm ready to open the package. That's right, I will have opened the package right after this. Wish me luck. Announcement 
Burger's first drive-through has opened in Crockle Bay. Now you can order your extra crunchy burgers without leaving the comfort of your car. And remember, order more than 10 Roach Burgers and get a free road shake. Roach, Roach Burgers! 24 hours a day. This is Two, two, two Point Radio.
announcement, toilets need routine servicing. Cold chill out everybody, we have a false alarm. It seems our mysterious foe was really a friend all along. The little guy was full of cookies from Mama Wolf. Thanks mom. Hopefully today's show has been a good example of how to deal with any unidentified device, suspicious object, or interfamilial gift. Now, I'm off to get some milk. Nigel Bickleworth on Two Point Radio. And once again, I, Sir Nigel Bickleworth, bid you a very cordial welcome to my humble show. For the next few hours, I shall endeavor to enlighten your gray little lives.
People say to me, Sir Nigel, how do you find the fortitude to continue such excellent work day after day? And I reply, because I have been bestowed the gift of broadcasting by some divine force, you simple peasant. One does what one is born to do, and I was born to play this next tune. have heard at some point over the course of your lives that it is improper to end a sentence with a preposition. Bosch and piffle, I hear you say. Yet it is undoubtedly true. Unless you wish to sound like a barbarian, you will never again utter a phrase such as, this isn't advice I'm going to listen to.
Feeling lightheaded? Please help. Not yourself? Please. Emitting light? What? Ah! Ah! Whoa. Thanks. Get checked at your local hospital today. This is Two Point Radio. Nigel Bickleworth on Two Point Radio. Bungle Meditech has announced a major breakthrough in the cure for baldness. Though they have refused to share any details, one wonders if this has anything to do with the explosion in Blyton, which saw a forest of hair spring up overnight.
This week, I headed to the Pointy Mountains for my Sir Nigel Reviews segment. If you have any plans of staying at the Underlook Hotel, I must warn you, be prepared to hear typewriter noises throughout the night. As if that weren't bad enough, there's blood coming off elevators and ghosts everywhere. Hardly a restful stay, I'm sure you'll agree. Please be handed in. 
at reception. Thank you. Honestly, the state of this radio station is deplorable at times. I have half a mind to speak to the janitor about it. In fact, I should call upon Mr. Henry Jobsworth, the county's health and safety inspector, and close personal friend of mine, to make his own assessment. I'll let you know how I get on.
If you're feeling ill, the last thing you want to do is pump your body full of cheap artificial medicine. So stay at a Holistics Hospital, where our natural remedies are so expensive, they just have to be good for you. Holistics, where you can only hope it sticks. Serving Two Point County. This is Two Point Radio. I have just spoken to Mr. Henry Jobsworth, the county's health and safety inspector, to report Two Point Radio's lack of hygiene. But I was told he's too busy visiting hospitals. I suggest the inspector re-examines his priorities. In the meantime, here's another dreadful tune.
You're listening to Ricky Hawthorne, the only radio DJ guaranteed to bring happiness into your lives. Now, let's listen to a nice, uplifting tune.
There's a funny sort of smell in the booth this morning. Burnt toast, I'd say, from a slightly pasted sell-by-date granary loaf. No, no, I tell a lie, I think it might be more of a seeded farmhouse. Now, I know what you're thinking. Sounds like something's gone wrong with old Ricky's brain, but the explanation is much simpler. That's right, the new air freshness from our sponsors, Krusty Fragrance, have arrived. So buy Krusty Freshness and your whole house could smell of toast.
Holistics, Environmental Medicine and Pharmaceuticals, the company's healthcare branch, also known as Hemp, has announced its hospitals will now be completely free of palm oil. Holistics will now use orangutan oil in all its medicine instead. Doctor required in surgery. Author and ambassador for the Bigfoot Foundation, Bartholomew F. Yeti is coming to talk at an artsy location near you for the 20th anniversary tour of his seminal work, Big Feet, Big Shoes. Critics call it urgent, confusing, and a nice color. Blink and you'll miss him. Buy your tickets now. This is Two Point Radio.
is Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. I've signed up for a long-distance learning class, how to build your own nuclear submarine. It's a childhood dream of mine, and I'm thrilled I'll finally make it come true after another 7,435 lessons. More great radio on the way.
In the news today, a group of backpackers have been airlifted out of Tumble Ridge after spending a week wandering the woods, then another week stranded on the edge of a cliff. It seems nobody broke anything or tried to eat anybody else. So that counts as a successful trip in my book.
Two Point County's valiant health and safety watchdog, Henry Jobsworth, has been called into the new Sweaty Palms fast food restaurant, Roach Burgers, home to the crunchiest burgers in town. No word yet on why the inspector's there.
Author and ambassador for the Bigfoot Foundation, Bartholomew F. Yeti is coming to talk at an artsy location near you for the 20th anniversary tour of his seminal work, Big Feet, Big Shoes. Critics call it urgent, confusing, and a nice color. Blink and you'll miss him. Buy your tickets now. is Two Point Radio.
Wanted Cardiology. Augusta Follicle has called in with her nice words of the day, which are sprinkle a little magic on your breakfast and give flight to your soul all day. A nice sentiment, Augusta, but we don't condone the taking of illegal substances on Two Point Radio. Listening to the voice of Nigel Bickleworth, your host and cultural guide on Two Point Radio. And what a splendid show I have for you today. Don't go anywhere.
Here is a list of things I like and don't like. Things I don't like. Almost anything you could care to mention. Things I do like. Making lists of things I don't like. More gems on the way after whatever sounds emanate from your radio when I'm not talking. Training course completed. Deluxe. 
For this edition of Sir Nigel Reviews, I thought I would brave the so-called wonders of the modern world and attend a three-dimensional screening at the local cinema. Why one would wish for an extra dimension to such drivel, I do not know. I spent much of the film ducking under the seat. I suggest you do the same. Automated snack machines need restocking manually. Let's 
become full. Constructed opulent bay towers in Pelican Wharf. Our exclusive apartments have all the everyday essential conveniences: Mega Mac Cinema, Bowling Alley, and eight bathrooms, two of which are fitted with golden toilets. Well, I say. And if it's real luxury you're after, come see our penthouses. Pelican Wharf, pricing normal people out of the market. This is Two Point Radio.
This is Nigel Bickleworth on Two Point Radio. The sport of kings may be polo, but the sport of gentlemen is played at the sloop. You won't see me there, of course. Far too much rough and tumble even in the stands, but it's nice to know it's there. One crucial thing to really understand when it comes to grammar, do not listen to those who say that language is a flexible, evolving thing. It has rules, and they must be obeyed, else we exist in linguistic chaos, and civilization will surely crumble. And yes, that split infinitive at the start was a little joke. Ha ha.
A bit of a fiasco down at the Bungle Technologies lab this morning, I hear. It seems they were trying to collide two artificially created black holes, but the whole experiment went nowhere. Back to med school for the senior doctor who's forgotten everything he knows. I don't know what to do! He wants to learn medicine. I'll pass. But he needs to learn about himself. Dad! Roderick Cushion is Dr. Roderick Cushion in Backwards, the show that everybody's hearing about. New episodes every week on Bungle Pictures. More Two Point, more often. This is Two Point Radio.
that time of day again. That's right, folks. Harrison Wolf is back on the airwaves. Stay tuned for my unique brand of enthusiastic banter. my mind. 
Bungle have released a new vitamin tablet that incorporates nanotechnology. You heard me. The tablet scans your body for the vitamins it needs and then synthesizes them. Either that or it explodes inside you and kills you.